So one thing that I wanted to show you, uh, let's say when you do uh, a close-up and uh, you have, uh, you know, for example, in our case, we have a woman and, you know, our skin doesn't look that soft. And, and you know, we, we could eventually with DaVinci make the skin look smoother. So that's what I'm going to show you. It's really easy, actually. So we're going to go into our coloring segment and we're gonna pull out the scope to first try to you know correct the rgb curves so uh when we take a look at it seems like we have a little work to do on balancing everything almost there all right Maybe this part Okay, now we're going to select the skin so that we can come to the part where we want to show how to smooth out the skin. So let's select the, the skin. Almost there. Okay, so you're going to go in that little tab. And you see here, it says mid-tone details. So we're going to, you know, put the mid-tone details lower and it's going to soften the skin. You see here, it already did kind of a big job, but we're gonna go a little extra hard. I'm gonna go like this. And there is much smoother. For example, just to show you, we went from this to this, right? Um, so now we are going to select the lips that are pink. Try to not lose the the pink of the lips basically well, let's go so you see this the skin because the skin and the, the lips are a little bit kind of the same color we're starting to select the skin by selecting the, um, the lips so what we're going to do is that we are going to you know create a shape so that we only have the lips basically Now maybe let's do a little something with the eyes too. So now that we did that, we could eventually work on our background. this so it's good when when your mask is kind of soft so that way it's not that obvious that you know you're doing this and it, everything has to look organic basically so I'm gonna create an outside node and then try to give a little style to my background like this in the blues Tack. there i start to look a little cool like it um maybe i should desaturate a little bit just to put more are in evidence and for it to be more subtle and um, now let's work on the sharpness and everything let's see we still see a lot of the okay there pretty cool um, now let's look at our scope uh, okay what we're gonna do is that we're gonna bring down the exposure a little bit like this is more of something that I like like bringing the exposure around 896 
you can do I mean at this level there is no right or wrong it's just whatever you like basically and and we're gonna you know the black a little higher to kind of have a almost like a flat type of thing but not so much all right and maybe a little more color uh, no like that yeah so basically if you look at the skin it's really smoothed out thanks to what we did earlier in the mid-tone details so we went from this you see to that so that's pretty it's pretty good if you ask me but uh, so that's a way to kind of like uh, soften the skin of your actress and uh, you know if you need the shot to be a little glamorous and everything again I'm not a colorist it's just a few things that I figure out and that I'm trying to share with you so I hope it helps uh, might not be the only way or the right way to do it but you know that's uh, just wanted to share what I'm learning, basically. All right. See you next time.